Hello everybody, and welcome back to Sly 3. When last we left off, the Panda King had joined our cause. And he raised merry hell <laughs> with micro-missile swarms worthy of Titanfall. But we still need one more person. We remember seeing Dimitri back at the start. So now we are on to episode 5, Dead Men Tell No Tales. Yar. Tell already was going to be an interesting pirate adventure. We got the message late one Saturday night. Dimitri was calling in the favor I promised him back in Holland. Hold it. Oh my god, he types a lot. He gone ahead and booked the whole He's talkative. Team passage under assumed identities. Whoa. To none other than Blood Bath Bay. Sly looking like Ali G on there. This town on Earth. It's home to a group of cultural hermits who doggedly maintain the ways of their pirate forefathers. The cruise over gave us some time to get the rundown from Dimitri. I Ooh, guess that's not a good look. That's not a good look. Was a pioneer in deep sea diving. He'd made a fortune looting undersea wrecks. Although his luck ran short when a young cutthroat by the name of Black Spot Pete stole not only his loot, but his precious diving gear as well. A broken man, Remy retired from treasure hunting and eventually started a family. Dimitri, growing up on his grandfather's stories, dreamed of one day recovering the gear. So that was our Not task. The treasure? We've been called in to get our hands on this miraculous diving equipment. Not all bad, really. If things go our way, the team might get a frogman out of the deal, which Bentley <laughs> figures will be a big help cracking the Cooper ball. That Bentley, always thinking. Wait a slightly like Ali G. Oh, okay, no introductory cutscene. Alright. Black Spot Pete has what? retired and is living here in town. I'll mark his place with a waypoint. Oh, hi. Nice. Skull minted coins. Kindly? I've been doing some money grinding off screen, so I managed to get some cash, but still not nearly enough to satisfy the frankly ridiculous thirst for coin this game has. So that may be that may be something I'll just have to do or <laughs> do like after the game is completed. Yeah, there's there he man. Is Black Spot Pete. I didn't think pirates could get that old. Thought scurvy would get him or something. <laughs> Don't lower your guard for an instant. All pirates are killers, plain as that, and they don't trust outsiders at all. How's your pirate accent? Arr, I forgot me number two pencil for the Scantron test. Joke all you want, but that guy won't help us out until you've earned his trust. He's all snaggletooth. Alright, so do I have a pirate disguise? Not by the looks of things. Alright, we'll talk thief to thief then. I'm just going to walk right up to him. What's up? Black Spot Pete. I've come to talk of treasure, a subject I hear you're familiar with. Treasure! Aye! But I won't chatter with the likes of you on so blessed a subject. Get out of his sight, landlubber! All my years I only spoke of the gold and kindness with me father. Can't tank on a stem. Maybe we can work out a bargain. Shut your mouth, whole lover. I'll cock it with me cutlass. Hard on the tonsils, I assure you. Well then, he's gonna be no bloody help. 
Salt of the earth, that black spot, Pete. It's clear to get anywhere with the old coot. We'll need to fool him into thinking that you're cantankerous, Tim. What happened to Tim anyway? His lieutenants mutinied on the old guy and divided the plunder, including his captain's outfit. This is the only real pirate town left. They must be around here somewhere. You're right. That's Stone Jake. Toughest guy you'll ever meet. He took the eye patch. Hmm. Okay, Tough we need to assemble the disguise. Good plan. That'll do the job, matey. Yar. Stone Heck. Jake has a thing about monkeys. If you whack the palm trees, he's sure to come running. Perfect for luring him under the anchor. What? Be that monkeys? Oh, hi. Remove. Remove people as we go. Three devils! Tree devils. Simeon demons. Run with your opposable pumps. Eat <laughs> the banana eaters. Uh oh. Uh oh. Invisible. Ooh. Stone Jake's in position. Drop anchor. Tricky Mashed. Yay, eye patch. Alright. Nice Not work. One. I've already got a bead on the second lieutenant. He's in motion near the overturned boat. So, oh, he's up there. There's the second Ooh. lieutenant. You need to steal his peg leg. Peg leg? Oh, seriously? Devil? Isn't that kind of harsh? You'll need it for the costume. It's very unique. Look, what you need to worry about is getting past his bodyguards. I'll have to pick them off one by one. Shouldn't be a problem. Okay. Something to draw them away. Outfit, unfortunately. Creep him. Oh God. He brought friends. Okay. Not expect. Oh. I was not expecting that. Listen here, matey. You're not getting away. Yeah. Didn't flatten him, but he get his attention. Okay. Sneak up behind him and pickpocket the screws from his peg leg. Screws. <laughs> and just whipped it clean out from under him. Excellent work. You've just got one lieutenant left. Twitchy Neb. I'm afraid word's gotten out that someone is taking down lieutenants, and he's hiding out up in a crow's nest. How do I get up there then? Ah, there's a rope. They're everywhere. The fogs are closing in. Stay awake. Keep your wits about your head. Stay sharp. Yes, sharp as an axe. Sharp. Ah! I know it. Tis true. An agent of Thames come for revenge. Chase him Whoa. down. He's got Tim's hat. Get here! Will not escape me!
Damn it, sit still. Alright, he's got he's got some ups. Ow! You dick! Ah, dang it. Nice try. Got that one on himself. Oh, that's a, a hit, but not quite enough. There's... Ah. Dang it. I know. <laughs> I pressed circle and then pressed R1. Yeah. Last mate, so. Oh, I think I've locked him in. Okay, I just need to chase him. Hitting him won't do do any good. Just need to run out his course. Yeah, because he actually accelerates, as I like, for it again. Um, he actually gets close, he actually gets faster as I get closer. Side. You won't take me. There we go. Running out of places to run to. What's your skyline if you don't pop? Ah, there he goes. Oh, you've done run out of land, my friend. Back him! Avast there! You've got me with me back to the sea! I yield! I just wanted your hat. Me hat? That's what this be about. Take the moldy cut of cloth and away with you! How much of this would be solved if you could just talk? <laughs> you could just talk this stuff out. So now. Alright, Skies. He's probably going to prompt us on a whole lot of uh, pirate lore. Oh, damn it. Hang on, I need to. I need to get above and then drop down. Because I can't jump in the pirate outfit. Aye! Out with the skeleton password! What? Easy one, here you go. Jib port spar hole. Ah, <sighs> too bloody. What the hell? All right, that was a weird. Dis that was a weird password. Oof, my phone. So it's not beeping into the microphone. Back, you two-faced Galloway. Aye, matey. And not to be rude, but let's talk of treasure. Our how about a round of vinegar talk first, you baboon faced toilet? I've read about this, Sly. It's customary for pirates to engage in insult competitions. Just make sure you never repeat anything that's already been said. You take right. the first broadside shipmate. Brainless, broadside sack of maggots. You're a brainless, cross-eyed sack of maggots. Ha <laughs> But methinks you're a stupid, scurvy-ridden waste of skin. Hey, eating 
seaweed slurping anchor head. You are a bleeding. <laughs> I love the kind of slight slurping. hesitation as he's like, uh. Ah, you swear like a child. You're a pin headed, grod abusing cow pie. This is going to get tricky. You're a donkey-eared, clam-tongued piece of filth. That'd be true enough, but you're a blathering, twisted bag of vomit. Okay, we are running out of, uh... We're running out of ideas here. Yellow-bellied How much more of... But methinks you're a sheep brain knuckle dragon whale fart. <laughs> Mumbling, pus faced swather. Oh, yeah. <laughs> How long does this go you're on for? Mumbling, pus faced. We've done like swather. five rounds now. It has already been said no pirate worth his salt would reuse an insult. It's a crime before nature. Hey? Oh. What did I? Oh, what? Re, what did I repeat? Crap. Oh, is he gonna make me do this whole bloody affair again? You take the first broadside, shipmate. All right. You're a pig breath, duck build, sack of maggots. I'm gonna have to start taking like notes. Child. You're a cricket sized, toothless waste of skin. A ruined, barnacle backed piece of filth. You're a marooned, barnacle backed piece of filth. Filth. The way he pronounces that is amazing. Blathering, twisted whale fart. You are a idiotic seaweed slurping cow pie. That be true enough, but you're a pin headed, scurvy ridden. Oh, really? You're a donkey eared, cross eyed cabin boy. Ha! You swear like a child. You're a. You've already done that one. Clam tongued bag of vomit. You're a parrot loving cross eyed swabber. Tis already been said no pirate hey? worth his salt would Is something going on here? Because I definitely haven't used swabber before. before I'm going to have to start like taking notes on what I have and haven't done. Ugh. Let's sit up a little straighter. That's probably going to help. I just fucking clout him. Take the first broadside, shipmate. Eat brained grog abusing anchor head. You're a sheep brained grog abusing anchor head. <laughs> but methinks you're a stupid puss faced bag of vomit. <laughs> Maybe I just need to avoid Swabber, because that always seems to be the one that gets me. That be true enough, but you're a idiotic, twisted piece of filth. You are a mumbling, yellow bellied whale fart. Ha! Ah, you swear like a child. You're a donkey eared. His eyes twitch and me out. Waste of skin. Ruined. Okay. 
avoid Swabber, because that one seems to trick me. That... You're a marooned barnacle bat cabin boy. Ha ha ha! But methinks you're a parrot loving, cross eyed Swabber. Hey, you've already done. Alright. Apparently he's allowed to repeat Agreed. shit, but I'm not. You're a blathering knuckle dragon sack of maggots. Ha ha! Tim, it must be. Okay. We made it. Sunburnt eyes for not recognizing you straight away. I've never met a man on land or sea that could curse half as well. Tell me, shipmate, why after so long away do you drop anchor now? I've come for me share of the treasure we stole years back from that Rémé Lousteau fella. Twas a good haul, that. Uh, speak of it while drunk often. <laughs> you and I burying the loot in the belly of Dagger Isle. Oh, and many a year I kept the map to the treasure hidden, safe as a swaddling babe. Arr, then let's have it. High time we dug up our retirement and lived as lord. It shames me fierce to tell you, shipmate, but I lost my galleon in a game of cards. And worse yet, the map was stolen by that terror, Captain Lefui. What was that? What? I'd have what was that about safe as a baby? Before giving up so treasured a parchment. This Lefui's no ordinary buccaneer. No. He's earned the reputation as the smartest man of the seven seas. The devil lives in yonder keep. Tis there you'll find the map and your death as well. If you go for the treasure ship, mate, you go alone. Missy Ferranty's alone behind me. Thank you, Pete. You've been a good friend. Aye, and you're still a skinny, malodorous, hairy palmed bottom feeder. Now that's just rude. All right, a couple of trips there, but we made it. First, Murray and Sly will steal a jolly boat and blast the rudders off any ships that could chase us out into the open ocean. The action is sure to provoke the harbor patrol, so be prepared for a sea battle. With them out of the way, no one can stop us from leaving harbor. Meanwhile, Penelope and I will work together to break into Lafuy's keep and steal the map to the buried treasure. Once both objectives are reached, we'll steal a ship and set sail for Dagger Island. Then it'll be a simple Simple, I'm sure. I'm sure there's not going to be a horde of pirates already there. Alright. Let's blow some shit up. So I got some new abilities for uh, our boy Murray here. Got the guttural roar. We also got temporal lock. Freeze time around the guards temporarily. And now, everybody's frozen. Just run up and sock them. Right, so, where am I needed? Over there. Whoa. Alright, apparently his big idea is to just drop the, uh, the cannon on my head. I admire your inventiveness, but that's not how it works. Alright. Close the box, and over. Pow. Right on the dome. God oh, bless you, Murray, you're a powerhouse.
Alright. Okay, Murray, I need you and Sly to blast the rudders off all the galleons in port. With their boats disabled, the pirates won't be able to chase after us when we sail for Dagger Island. What about those boats out there at anchor? They look ripe for a breaking. Don't worry about it. The pirates won't have time to row out and get the rig before we're gone. Besides, once you start shooting at those rudders, the harbor patrol is sure to show up. That sounds like a job for a man of my many destructive habits. You said it. Take out the harbor <laughs> patrol. Be sure said it. No one left to chase after us when we appropriate a pirate boat. <laughs> a little eyebrow waggle from from, the uh, from uh, Bentley there. Luck, sailor. Appropriate. Okay. Doing this again. Hold down the R1 button to charge the shot and Wee. Let go with one fire. Oh, Nelly. Ouch. Nice going, guys. You're really working as a team. That boat's not setting sail anytime soon. I just crash into the. No, I can't just crash into the turrets to knock them out. Let's get some distance. Really gonna long arm this. Where'd it go? Man, this. This thing charges real fast. Ow. Three, where's the last one? Around the corner. Okay, boats are now immobilized. Yeah, now for the harbor right, patrol. But it's time to bump it up a notch. The harbor patrol has arrived. They look pretty well armored. Is this cannon gonna cut it? You're right, Sly. Murray needs to ram them with your jolly boat to knock off the armor. Oh, all right. Right. I'm tired of dodging cannonballs. Time to crack some skulls, jolly boat style. Yeah. Once Murray has got a big old ramming car in front as well. Need to Look at that. With a well placed cannonball. Run in fear, Harbor Patrol sissies. I'm going to ram you in the next week. Yar! Judge. He's down to wood. Get here. Uh, I need, okay, I need to actually. Really, I need to really build up some speed. Armor's gone. There we go. This guy's clear. Fire, you're on fire. God. Nice. The armor's gone. And come on, I need to properly. Okay, you need to get, like, a run-up. Ah, oh, damn it. I was not paying attention to my health. Charge! He's playing, ready to shoot. He's down to wood. Go. Armor's gone. Oh, wait, if you hit them dead on, they can just, they can sometimes just explode. He's playing, ready to shoot. Okay, so ramming them in the back doesn't really work. You've got to, like, get them dead on or, like, T-bone them. Right. Oh, wow, he blew himself up. Murray and his faithful gunner Sly kick butt yet again. Uh, 
sorry, guys. I wasn't aware the Harbor Patrol had a cutter. You're not done yet. Oh, all right. Yeah, We're gonna sink a big boy. Everything has a weak point. Just look at the mast. They've been patching it up for a while now. Slice right. That mast will fall before our combined might. Oh god, it looks like it's held on with no tape. How many cannons they bring to bear, we will bear it. Not to sound like a wimp, but I vote we dodge their cannonballs. Or we can dodge. That works too. <laughs> The trick with cannons is that they can only really face in one direction. Ooh, I heard a crunch there. Duh. Oh, just a couple more hits like that should do it. I like how like, janky sounding this music is. One more support beam left. There we go. That thing is now immobilized. Oh, or it just sinks. Blub, blub, blub. We would have been sunk without your rowing. When you guys are done making out, I'll see you back at the same house. Get a room. Right. Now, back to the safe house so we can switch over to Bentley. can actually fire their cannons, they don't just beat you with them. Double knockout. Didn't know what hit them, because it was each other. Same house right up here. Excuse me. Decent chunk of change out of that as well. Oh, I might be able to. Um... Whoa! I just kind of like warped upright. What's new on the uh, on the old buying front? Yeah, more boatloads of stuff. Look at how expensive this is. Ah! Ooh, attack people while invisible. That's a very good one. By the insanity strike for all. Bentley. I got Bentley a whole lot of stuff as well. So I've got him the uh, the there it is health extractor and the rage bomb. Um. We throw this over there. That causes a pop. And that turns them against each other. That'd be a great way to uh, get out of a pinch. I'm not going to be able to pickpocket them while they're fighting each other, unfortunately. Let's just boogie. Ah, oh, damn it. I'm going to pickpocket him first. Oh well. And it's boring. Don't you mind me. 
gonna go over here. Okay, Penelope, I'm in a position with your hover spectrometer. That? I'll watch the device Hover, and what? you scan for metal structures that resemble a safe or chest. Anything the treasure map might be stored in. Oh, I see. Spectrometer. Be still, my heart. She made an obscure NASA reference. Why do the girls always have to go for Sly? It's just not fair. What was that? I didn't reach ya. Oh, nothing. I was just saying that we've got fair winds for liftoff. Let's do it. Nice try. Wee. This thing spins. The data's coming in. It's caching in the spectrometer's matrix. What matter of witchcraft is that? Ah, well, best to shoot first and then ponder later. No! We haven't downloaded yet! Ah, the pieces are still intact! The All right, we we'll have to go fetch them then. Can still retrieve the data. But it's broken, and I rig all my gear to self-destruct if anyone tries to take it after a malfunction. Ah. The disc will destroy itself if someone tries to pick it up. Aha! What if we can read the disc's contents before touching it? Right! I could use my RC card and go out and collect the data. It's got the same code base as the disk and should be able to download its contents. That's it! Use all right. the card to recover all of the data and then we'll know where to strike inside the skull keep. I figured. think you need to worry about uh, Sly stealing away Penelope. Sly has only got what eyes for one lady. Oh god, do not roll the car. And witness! Perfect landing. Oh. Come on, I've got to do a K-turn. There we go. squad so we don't want to get into any fights. Yeah, have that. Uh, yeah, I could have just left him alone after tranking him, but I'm feeling punchy. Okay. Oh, there we go. But we need to get on top of the boat somehow. really taught you a lot. Sly? We're a team. In case you haven't noticed, I'm the brains of the operation. He's just the field man. Just the field man? Sounds like you're jealous. Well, we gonna... Whoa. Yeah, I, I wish I wasn't in this chair. Are we gonna have a falling I out? I wish I could run on tight ropes and jump on flag poles and all that stuff, but I can't. You can do other stuff, 
Sly can't rewire a satellite or write ASCII code. Sly can't even spell ASCII. Yeah, he's not the most technical guy. Hey, let's get moving. He's street we smart. The back entrance just standing around. Oh, oh, sorry about that standing comment. Give you a break, Penelope. It's just an expression. <laughs> Alright. Go down to the beach then. Oh, this seems safe. Yep. Oh, <laughs> whereas Penelope just. Stealth. Stealth. Thumping his head on the floor. In the drink with you. Who ever heard of a pirate that can't swim? Oh, this seems abundantly safe. Get a pack parkour. Aha, good. I kind of bought the, uh, the thing. The door here is locked, but you should be able to bomb the support to that upper walkway. Clear. Hey, and that brings that down. Now we're basically in the fort proper. Come on. There we go. And clear an LP. To explode you. Hey, we're up on the roof now. Ah, there's our man. Shh. That must be Lafui. Let's get up to where no one will spot us. Agreed. I'll tell you something by thunder. That disc in the sky was just the beginning. But, sir, it is gone. Them bridges is up and all's as clear as morning. Sure, sure. Every man's entitled to their opinion. <laughs> but I don't want to hear no more of them. I can make drones. Yes, sir. Yeah, we've been cloning all these people. You're now promoted to captain of the guards. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Double the patrols and keep an eye out. There's the storm blowing in. I'll be just inside torturing the prisoners. Call out if you need help. No, sir. I mean, I, I, sir. Seems like these guys are terrified of him. A lot of dudes. We can't get inside with these pirates guarding the door. Time for a little swashbuckling. I need a scrap. Just let them resolve the issue for us. There we go. You just sort it out amongst yourselves. One down. It's two down. And that's three down. Oh, okay, so it seems that um, if they hit each other while enraged, it transfers the rage from person to person. So, so long as one is infected, then they'll just keep, like, fighting amongst themselves. One and Kaplowy. Not too shabby. Hmm. Looks like a standard double button latch system. On right. three in pirates. One, two, three. In pirate, you say? Oh wow. This must be it. That's quite oh, a shrine. I've never seen a security chest so thick with traps. 
Spinning saw blades. Looks pretty straightforward. If I had my spanner set, this would be a cinch. Really? Well, let's head back to the safe house and get your tools. I'd like to stay here if you don't mind and study it some more. Sure, I'll be back in a flash. Just be amazingly careful, please. around there's open windows oh hell The plan, big guy. I an improved grapple cam on the way. This dust is really nasty. I can't see a thing. Let's... Wait. Where is she? She's up there. All right. Get up to a good advantage. Don't worry, Penelope. The pulleys holding up the bridges were too tough to take out with my sleep darts, so I upgraded my grapple. I heard the bridges fall, but I'm not sure I can make it back to the safe house blinded like this. I'll make a bird call through the grapple cam speaker. The guards won't think anything of it, and you'll be able to follow the sound back to the safe house. Just loudly announcing tweet tweet. safe house. It's down here. Slightly out of range. Sure. Okay. I hear ya. What a... Need 
her kind of around. There we go. And then up the ramp. There we are. Okay, there is a ramp down. It's not just a drop. Watch your step. Yeah, get us some, some water for a start. Alright. Alright. Uh-oh. <laughs> Something's gone wrong here. It's still playing the woobly noise on the grapple cam. Hopefully. Nope, loading into the mission has not fixed it. We might just have to deal. forward to this. Every thief dreams of one day stealing a pirate ship. I don't know what it is, but it's like a total rite of passage. This is gonna be great. You'll be the first on board. You might want to keep your enthusiasm quiet. If the Night Watch detects you, this whole place is going to get lit up with guards. The rest of the team won't stand a chance. Come on, pal. This is me you're talking to. I'm like a fourth degree black belt at this kind of stuff. Murray will meet you at the Jolly Boat. But remember, keep it quiet. Okay. Do not get spotted. Understood. Oh god, it's even still playing in the pause menu. Okay, we may just have to, to deal. Looks like they mined the harbor after our last boat trip. Must have really spooked these guys. That's it. Thankfully, I have bought the uh, stealth kill power. I'm a very high rate. Oh, without being detected at all. All right. Okay, there we go. Reloading fixed it. Uh, Alright. Let's equip stealth. Floating diamond. Ooh, big old diamond. Are you kidding? He glitched into a wall and that didn't count. Ugh. Thankfully, I still get to keep the, the gems. Get to keep pickpocketing these guys. There we go. Okay, guys, the coast is clear. Come on up. Roger! I'll start rowing people over! Okay, the rest of the gang is below deck. Let's fire this puppy up. <laughs> it's a sailboat. Once we raise the sails and get underway, it won't be long before someone I'm sure raises an alarm. No problem. We wasted that harbor patrol. The coast is clear. Literally. 
You guys did a great job, but they still have cannons mounted up in Skull Keep. I figure it's long odds they get gun crews into position before we're out of range, but it's worth mentioning. Then let's make full sail for the mouth of the harbor. If you guys are ready, I say we do it now. Every second we dilly-dally just puts us at more risk. Agreed. Murray, take up the anchor. Bentley, get down below deck and adjust the ballast. I'll hoist the sails and get this thing moving. Okay, Sly, you're in command. Sailing is easy. Hold down on the L2 button to turn left and the R2 button to turn right. Okay, so we're just instructing... We're just instructing Murray. Alright, this is going to be interesting. My spongy-ass controllers. We're almost out of range! Excellent, we've made it into open water! Okay. <laughs> just interacting with the cannons does a full broadside. Got it. Don't need to interact with each one individually. Wanted to give that a quick test. Ooh. Keep using the L2 button and R2 button to steer the ship. The wind around this archipelago consistently blows from the south. Maintain a good angle, or we won't be going anywhere fast. I marked Dagger Island on the sea chart. Click the right analog stick to bring it up and get your bearings. Blimey, this thing goes like sting. Just over there. Be right around here. There's another treasure chest. Honk. Wow, that had five. That that floating treasure chest had five coins in it. You're the captain. Turn our boat to give him a broadside with the cannons. If you fire at them from the front or behind, our cannonballs will do tons more damage as they travel the length of the enemy ship. Ah, alright. Oh, he's facing us dead on. Bank around. Come on, cannons, cool down. Pow. Oh, we're losing speed. Alright. Bank right. Then, oh damn it! Oh, this is gonna sting. Race. There's a hole in our ship. Find the trouble spot and swipe at it to nail down the deck board. I don't know how there was water pouring out of that part of the boat, but taking a little bit of damage. Their mast has fallen and their boarding nets are down! Pull up alongside and jump aboard the enemy vessel. There's sure to be treasure. Or just give her another broadside and sink her to the bottom of the ocean. We've got no bloody speed because we're going counter to the wind. Go on. Bring her in for a steel kiss. I've played Black Flag, I know how this goes. And... Consider yourselves boarded. Okay, this one can actually swim. I got the upgraded spin attack. In the drink. And... Diamond! Is there actually anything here to find? You've got the map, Sly. Select it as a power-up and read its clues to find the treasure. 
I believe the first clue is stand before the statue's gaze to begin your walk along the treasure's maze. Oh, why are they always rhyming couplets? Okay, it's done that for me. So, statue's gaze. Alright, let's have a poke around and see what we can see. Oh. 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 Oh, nice, and we actually have to... Oh, I see, there's going to be some clues about, like, six paces south or something like that. Right. Let's look for this. It seems that Pete's boys are already here defending the treasure. That looks like a gazing statue, if I did have to say. Right, this is going to be Heads tricky. Up, Sly, this island is home to some near-sighted lizards. They can't see very far ahead, but they'll bite you in half, given a chance. Well, the trick is to just not give them the chance. Okay. Statue's gaze. Hey. Oh crap. Oh, I have to prompt it for the next clue. Okay. So. This is it. Follow the rest of the clues on the map to find the treasure. Take ye twelve steps in the direction of the statue's gaze. So that's one, two. Five, Slide, six, when you've seven, got the eight, right number nine, of paces, ten. stop and hit the circle button to get the next clue. Great. If you need to leave map mode for a while, don't worry about it. You just marked an X on the ground, which will make it easy to come back and pick up where you left off. X marks the spot. Take ye six paces towards it. Six. While in map mode, Simple. you can use the right analog stick to scan your immediate area. It might be helpful to find this circle of palm trees mentioned in the glue. I'm going to assume it's that. So. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. Sixteen paces to pass between two great stones. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Looks like you'll need to, to leave that to solve this clue. Look around. Normal with the right analog stick for this island with three palm trees. When you find it, bring up map mode again, and your direction marker will be pointing in the same direction. Okay, so island with three palm trees, there we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, thirteen. Let's just move this guy. There we go. So, now where was I? So, wrecked ship, six paces. One, two, three, five, six. Oh, SOS! Small box. Well, Dimitri, it's your loot. I think you should have the honor. <laughs> I open with joy. You Cooper gang is a tight groove. Van Gogh bullseye. The primo diving gear to accentuate my deep down diving style. It's so intricate. Your grandfather was an artist. I've never seen such fine craftsmanship. 
He had the juice. Check it. The gear even matches my suit. Juice. I can dance, dive, and accessorize. What else is in this chest? Mm. Aye. Let's get a good look. Mm. <laughs> Avast, lovers. Didn't think you could steal from the smartest man of the seven seas and not taste the repercussions. Har, har, har. I might have been late for the opening of the chest, but I'm just on time for the stealing of the gold. Let Penelope go. We can work out a deal. Penelope be the lass's name. But he has a sonnet, and what a rich sweet scent from the wench's hair. <laughs> Let's stop this chump! No, he'll hurt her! This guy's a killer! Hey, You sum me up with butter word! <laughs> killer! Away with ye! Back this guy's fantastic! Gold is mine now, but her death is yours! Take your choice! Guys, we don't have any options here. Everyone back to the ship. You can't just abandon me! Help! Please! I'm so scared! Penelope, not abandoning do you. what he says! Stay alive! We will save you! I... I trust you. And I trust you still plan and logging back to your ship. Away with ye! Now! Well, crap. Where's King Panda? Could have just shelled all of them. I assume we're going to have an opportunity to um, give Dimitri a spin. So, I imagine. Given our current situation. All right, we're summoning the bloody Kraken. This will be good. Let's do this. I see. Oh, I see. We need to take command of the ship. circle around and we will uh, take Dimitri for a scrape. Hope you've got an air compressor on this boat. This might be tricky because we've actually got to head south. I may end up needing to use actual like sail actual sailing tricks the actual trick that you do when you're trying to sail kind of against the wind is you need to uh, Slalom. Going in the right 
direction. No, we are still... Alright, we need to get clear of these... ...of these islands. There we go, we've caught the wind, we're moving... Let's not tangle with these guys. the right kind of direction. I would have thought that, um, wait, there we go. I would have thought that, uh, the chapter based around piracy would have, like, some better, uh, money rewards. I'm getting like five, five gold coins a piece out of these. Uh, just crash into the beach here. We are close to the shipwreck. Drop anchor near the beach. There we go. Are you all set with your gear? You got the gear. Got the macho swimsuit. Got more juice than you. That is not a good look. I'm a hit singer with a bullet. Cool, daddy -o. How about you take your pip self down neath the H2O and get nasty with the scuba? Yo, with bling. Hey, man. You can try, but you'll never capture my essential style. <laughs> like smoke. Ungrabbable and all over the place. But no matter nothing, come at me with some turtle talk. You've got your own flavor. Fine. Your objective is beyond the reef. We're looking for some more of these cannon blast amplification callers. We'll move the boat above the wreck and lower a basket for you to drop them into. Ooh, cool, bro. I'll cut the collars and spice up your basket big time. Solid. Hey, uh, you want some depth optimizers for your scuba mask? It might help you spot sharks. Uh... 3D. Use the action buttons to move forward, left, Whoa. right, and back. Hit the R1 button to fire your spear gun. Whoa. Whoa. Okay. Having Devil May Cry 1 flashbacks here. Alright. This is weird. Alright. To go down this way. Oh, this seems safe. Yeah, um, <laughs> pro tip from someone who isn't a pro at diving do not do this. Do not swim into little, little crevices that you can't see the other end of. Where is the... Uh, where is the basket? It's above... Oh, there it is. Just... Ah, there we go. Excellent. Straight These in. cannon blast callers will be invaluable in our fight against the Death's Head. Without this upgrade, our cannons couldn't make a dent. Find five more, and we're... That's two. Only four more to go. You're a lifesaver, Dimitri. We had a few blast callers on board, but without a full set, it's hard to calibrate the guns for synchronized discharge. Okay. You're You're half there. Some Just kind of terrifying one. cannon muzzle break. It's three. This one's number four. Around a little ah, there's number five. So it seems that you're able to avoid the sharks fine enough so long as you just keep moving. We just need one more. Is it though? Ah, 
Aha! It's under the boat. Oh, there's a whole bunch of them down here. How kind of you? Swimming, oh god, that icon is terrifying. Did anyone else just get like a subnautica flashback there? Okay, classic bullfight technique. Two hits will kill it. Got it. There you are. So Anyone reckon we're gonna are we gonna run into a eldritch horror from beyond time? Come on. Oh come on, I went through him. Die, there we go. Green beast is gonna have us. Mouths. Got him. Magnificent, bro. Your method and madness have cold set us up with a fat pirate gap. You're a solid gold all star on the team Cooper label. We're ready to go toe to toe with a death's head. We'll see how smart that left wee is with a cannonball in his face. <laughs> God, Dimitri, you're so ugly. <laughs> I love his design, but God, he doesn't look well, does he? Those huge bags under his eyes. Got some money. Have we got enough to do anything with, though? Not really. Alright. Sly, you're up. So, you know what? We mentioned Eldritch Horrors from Beyond Time. Let's go say hi to one. And this thing can really move when you actually catch the wind.
not pictured is the days upon days of travel time it takes to get anywhere on a sailing boat. Faster than on foot, but it's still pretty fucking slow. It's basically straight northeast from here. Northwest, rather. Maybe we should keep the boat. Put like a proper engine on this sucker. Might be useful for any future heists. We've already got a, a van and a plane, so kind of surprised that a boat has been this far out of the question so far. It's getting misty. Close. Frame rate is not happy. Oh, I've completely overshot it. So, yeah. That was weird. Apparently, this isn't it. Oh, there we go. Well, these deep, misty waters are said to be home to the monster. Keep a sharp eye out. Sorry, Bentley, but I can't see a thing in this fog. If your sea monster's here, there's no way we'll find him. Well, it's imperative we track it down and discover why the pirates fear it so vehemently. It's because it's a sea monster, Do you have Bentley. Any fireworks that might light the place up a little? Make it easier to spot the creature? Some flares. My fireworks are not flares. They burst yeah. with ferocious beauty and then disappear like the lightning. We should really get out of here. With visibility this bad, we might sail into a rock. The boat might take some real damage. Oh, what in the hell? He's pulled our bloody masts off. Okay, now that's some real damage. The sea monster is upon us. Go below deck and placate the others. I will confront this creature with my firework artistry. Give us right, a it's backup. Time for a fight. Ready. So any amount of a hit gets him to back off. Alright, I'm getting it now. Yeah. Alright, a little bit, a little bit sooner. Oh boy! So, this guy is large. You face me. Behold the Panda King, your master. Turn up onto here. Oh god! Okay, I can't target the head. Change the boat. I can just do Oh, now I can target it. Why didn't that work before? Eat micro missiles. 
I used to play Toad in Titanfall, I know how this goes. Oh, I see. He's trying to just bring the boat down. Things are looking pretty bad down here. Stay on top of damage control. I got this. tentacles does this thing have? We're almost over. I've got this. He's backing off. Yeah, there he is. Oh, yeah, frame rate. Rise and let me punish you. Woof. Look at somehow just like looking directly at this thing just kills the frame rate. Right up. Dip into like 10 frames a second here, this is nuts. Are you backing off? Timid creature. With my beautiful fireworks, I will. I. They are all gone. Cooper! Your assistance is requested! I'm here. What's the score? Protect the vessel while I go below and hurriedly craft more fireworks. Ah, Should he's out of ammo. <laughs> Bentley, you check out that fight? Crusher must be on its last legs at this point. I mean, what could he have left? Don't tempt him. Oh, no! Just a rough guess. That was just the tip of his head. Oh, hell. Oh, we're on fire. Perish. Bombs away. You try and do this on a single broadside. Cannons are nearly ready to go again. Swing. Surely he can't have much left by now. Ah, damn it. That just slightly wrong. Go on, come at me. Boom! 
Right in his eyeball. Get him. Full salvo. A grand battle that was. Worthy of the names King and Cooper. You really softened him up for me. That was a solid action reaction, bros. You two stand tall. Say, Guru, could you get inside this creature's mind? Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> that doesn't seem safe. That's a brilliant idea. But are oh. you sure you can pull it again. off? Hey, Baba Hi, Baba Wanda. But let's do it. Just take any precautions you can. What's he trying to do? Getting us a new ally out here in the sea. Hi, Baba Daha. All right, we apparently now have. Oh crap! Master, don't leave us. We might have just gotten him killed. That's a problem. Crap. Well, apparently we're going to go on and do the. Uh, the battle regardless. Nope. No way to force reset the cannons, unfortunately. Ow, 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 ow. On that one. Oh, we're taking water. That's one of the guns as well. Bank around. And hard, hard, hard left. I didn't do anything. Oh no, he is sm ouch, he's smoking. Oh crap, we are gonna sink. Just fix that, you dicks. We're losing guns here. <laughs> yep. We done got sank. Okay. It actually starts uh respawn us closer. <laughs> not gonna I'm not gonna bother with uh sea fights. Those red sail guys should be around here somewhere. And their sails are blue. We're closing in on one of the red sail sea dog clan. Beat two quarters. What does that mean? We've got one away from the rest of the fleet. Make sure to board the enemy vessel once their mast has fallen. We need to find out the patrol routines for the rest of the clan. With some planning, we should be able to ambush them in small groups. Makes sure to start fire already. around first. Oh, come on.
Something's wrong. There we go. Deal with this red sail captain and his mercenary crew is sure to surrender. Oh, friendly fire I saw. Tell he's the captain because he's got the biggest hat. Hey, and we got their maps. Whoa. Nice swashbuckling, Sly. I've analyzed the patrols. Okay. Hush my smart mouth. Apparently, uh, doing. The sea battles are actually worth quite a lot of money. Just for some reason that first one that I did didn't count. Get ready, fellas. We're closing in on the action. Alright, where are they? It's a three on one battle. You're up for it, Sly. Use some sailing strategy and we'll carry the day. Or we just get exploded. God, they're behind us. Way to get health back after you've taken damage. It doesn't feel like there is. Alright, that's one down. We've lost most of the port guns. Ow! side to their front so we can there we go there's the last one over there ah oh, damn it get ready fellas we're closing in on the action right. uh, I'm just gonna take a real quick second we'll be right back <laughs> okie doke we're back God damn it. Just started. Crash into him. Damn it. Hang on. Ow. Okay. Sly himself doesn't seem to have a health bar when you're on the boat. Oh nice, I've taken out some of their guns. Oh damn it. Ah, uh, there's more holes. Our guns were supposed to be more powerful. On. Oh, nice! I managed to dodge that one. Ooh, dodge that one too. down. 
Long guns recharge faster. That's number two down. Okay, this goes a ways away, so I can take a moment to recharge the guns. Hi, Bavo. You've arrived just in time to watch me flounder a whole bunch at sea. On banking turn, launch! Oh, we felt that one. Well, apparently, this uh, is worth. Not really. Apparently, this is worth a whole lot more money than I had originally anticipated, so we're gonna do this. This episode is interesting fun, yeah. It's uh, very different to what I thought it was gonna be. I appreciate the change in, in, uh, in pace. I'm just going to keep smacking this dude off the boat. Okay, he doesn't seem to take any damage from flying off decks. But it is funny. Spin! Hey! Big old necklace. Sunk. Alright. This is worth a lot more than I, than I had originally thought. That's got me a good couple of hundred. Yeah, I'm up to uh, 1,600 now. All right, where to? We're off into Here Be Dragons territory, apparently. So I assume this part is going to be a five on one. Ah, healing crate. Hey! Come on, really. Hang on, I've got to bank around and come at this thing straight. Oh wow, that did not give much. Well, thankfully there was another one right there. And a third. There we go. We're in a much better position to do this fight now. Big one, you say? Oh, nice. They completely flood that shot. I've managed to shut all their gun ports on this side, so if we just keep plugging away at them. Sunk! Bank around. Full broadside. Oh, he felt that one. Recharge. Sneak a shot on this one. Nice. Wait, wait, I'm not ready. Oh god, all these guns are open on this side. Ow. Oh, that hurt. Keep matching him like this. Oh, I see. It's not damage that shuts their gun ports, they have to recharge their shots as well. Alright. Let's try and force ourselves around so we can get another broadside on.
Bring him in for a steel kiss. Looking thing. Wow, he hurts. Oh, you're gonna make me do it again? It's four against one. Stay sharp and keep out of their line of fire. These are tough odds. We made it work before. Turn, turn, turn. Stop that! Ah, damn it. Overshot. Focus one of them at a time. And turn. Ow. I didn't do it. been able to pick up a copy unfortunately. One down, which should make this easier, and this guy's already badly burnt. Quite enough to sink him. But yeah, I understand that Sly 4 is not particularly liked. So I'm just sticking with the uh, original trilogy. Yeah. Hit them in this range? No. Uh, after this, I will be playing Dead Rising 2. Decided to dig through the old uh, retro box and spotted that. Come on, Murray, can we get a wiggle on, please? sailing away from us, they're probably matching our speed. Are they both over there? Oh, they are. Never heard of that game? Wow. Um, it's a zombie survival game uh, done, published by Capcom. It's very, very good. The, the first one's good, the second one is fantastic, and the less said about 3 and 4, the better. <laughs> is the short version. I think we're gradually catching up on these guys. Is this all the speed we've got? Jeez. Let's try and... Sneaking a quick shot. Super funny in range yet. Nearly. No, that's Left for Dead you're thinking of. Dead Rising is the uh, sandbox one that's set in like Vegas. Well, the second one's set in Vegas. Well, Fortune City, if you want to tell. Definitely not Vegas. Dead Rising 2 did have co-op, but it wasn't four-player, it was only two-player, and it was kind of... silly. <laughs> what is going on? Come on, Murray, intercept course, let's boogie! I 
I think these guys' AI is bugged out because they're just sailing away from me. They're making no effort to actually attack. Nope, that's Dead Island you're thinking of. <laughs> yeah, no, um, the... Uh, Dead Rising, the, the first one was in was set in a mall. The second one was in, like, definitely not Vegas. And the uh, third one, I believe, was just, like, us fuck nowhere Mexico. And the less said about four, the better. Okay, I think we're finally catching up on these idiots. Maybe the AI will finally wake up once I get close enough. Try for another sneaky broadside. Maybe this will wake up their AI. There we go. That's some hits. Okay. Attack to the other side. And hit with the other guns. There he goes. This one. Oh, he's turning around. I think we've woken his AI up. Oh, come on. How was that not a hit? Bank around. I'll swing now that this bank of guns is cooled down. And... Kablooey! Since as we're already kind of low on time, I'm not going to bother. Yeah, since we apparently all uh, get money regardless, even if we sink him, so I'm just going to sink him. Bye bye, blub. All right, decent pile of cash. So we just kind of quietly forgotten about the fact that the guru fucking died. <laughs> like, where is he? He got pulled under and we haven't seen him. Operation Reverse Double Cross. Our goal, as we all know, is to save Penelope. Given her crafty nature, Left Wee has undoubtedly locked her up in one of his most secure locations. They are, one, the Skull Keep, and two, the Brig of the Death's Head. Our team is too small to assault both simultaneously, so we'll have to fall back on a little slide of hand. First, we sail in and exchange broadsides with the Death's Head. Armed with the element of surprise and our cannon upgrades, it should be a fair fight. But remember, Penelope might be on board, so we cannot sink this ship. Once the mass fall, Sly should jump onto the enemy vessel and then promptly surrender. A necessary step for two reasons. First, that boat is packed with pirates. Way too many to fight hand to hand. And second, it's the best way to get an audience with Lafui. Given his smug nature, he's sure to brag where she's hidden if we can get him angry enough. Got that Sly? Irritate the daylights out of this guy. It's our best oh, gladly. chance to oh, happily him. antagonize him. the situation. This Lefui is a smart man. Our only hope is to outsmart him at his own game. Alright. I'm I'm assu don't correct me, but I'm assuming the way it's gonna work is um oh, I should uh, do shopping. But uh, I assume the way it's gonna work is that all will appear to be lost, and then, uh, and then the guru will come riding in atop the sea monster to save the day. I assume that's how it's gonna work. 
Alright. We need to... Salt Bloodbath Bay. But yeah, I'll probably use uh, this minigame to grind for cash on on the side. Um, we're at two hours, but I'm gonna keep the episode going until we finish, uh, until we wrap up this chapter. Don't mind me, gentlemen. Just a perfectly honest pirate. Thread the needle. I don't want to be getting in any fights when I'm already low on time and hungry. Whoa. Closing. Alright. Have at ye. Battle stations, we're headed into action. It's gonna be tight sailing in here, Sly. Keep an eye on the rocks. Yeah, because we don't want to crash. Quick, bank left so we can use the other volley. Nice, we've got him nearly three volleys on this guy before he's even successfully hit us once. A regular pirate. Although hopefully we haven't reduced poor Penelope to dog food. Round back around. We need to sail in land a little bit. A bit too close to the walls. seen any smoke how much can this thing take that did it Ship packed with over a hundred pirates. Sure, your cane is up to the task of cracking all our skulls. I don't know about all of you, but yours, I'm sure it can manage. Yeah, restrain this man and keep your distance from the enemy vessel. This smells of lubber trickery. Take heart, boys. Been a while since we witnessed a good plank walking. Okay, so we've got to annoy the hell out of him. We'll need to look tough. Okay, so we've got to try and emasculate him. Uh, salt the ship. This plank's got splinters in it. I thought a prissy sailor like you would take more pride in his ship. Oh no, I take a great deal of pride working splinters into the feet of those about to walk my plank. Ah, just the extra touches that makes all the difference. He's so camp. I love it. Making me walk the plank? You're the pinnacle of creativity, Lefui. Not creative? I'm the smartest man in the seven seas, you... You slander scabbard! Oh, we're running out of... Okay. Hmm. Yeah, let's insult him back even harder. That's the best insult you can think of? I could do better in a coma, while speaking a foreign language, to deaf apes. Your 
wordsmithing is preposterous, mm. presumptuous, and patently premeditated. Time to put that slack tongue to use, mm. like giving the shark something to chew on. Yeah, play it cool. Play it cool. It. You're hurting my feelings. More name calling like that, and I'm leaving. Cheap action movie dialogue won't get you out of this one, Cooper. You're as good as dead, or my name's not Lefwe. It's probably not. It's probably a stage name. You've got a real knack for pirate talk. Put two nonsense words together, and pow! Scary pirate name calling. Bah! You might be quick with the put downs, but who's got the hidden girl? Ha ha ha! Me! You'll never find her! We are running out of. Running out of board here. Let's go real in. Yeah, Let's go real to, keep her locked up. to the hill. After all, if she ever got away, you'd never get a date. It is true, I have a strong personality. But I've never had a problem with the ladies, especially when I have a broadside aimed at their sailboat. Uh, savvy! <laughs> Alright. Pirate euphemisms now. I'm not worried about Penelope. A girl tough as that will free herself by tomorrow morning, then come and steal your wallet. Ha! That chickadee will never escape a skull keep. She's locked up in irons, and there she stays until she agrees to love me, despite all my faults. Now be the time sharks launched on your parts. You're the captain. Later, idiot. Step on it, Murray. They've got Penelope locked up in the skull keep. Check. Go, go, go. The lovers get in the way. After them, boy. Send up the signal flags. He's all out fire. Heads up, Murray. The whole town is trying to blast us. Oh, Murray's really getting a clip. Drop me off at the dock. I'll make a run for Penelope. You keep the boat safe. We're gonna need it for the escape. Safe as a baby. Now get moving. Let's storm this place. Back route up the skull keep. Jump on the floating boxes. Penelope and I made a walkway all the way to the top. Okay. We can't go in the front. We've got to go in the. Oh, damn it. We've got to go in the same way the others came in. Oh, come on. Goodbye. <laughs> oh god. Goodbye. Well, oh, that was a different animation. Usually he does like a cap to his chest thing. Oh, the trick is not to lose half your health before you even join the fight. You. Okay, these guys aren't going to stop coming, so let's just move. Uh huh. Slide. Perfect. Easy with Bentley. These guys apparently didn't think to clean up the boxes through at the three days we were at sea. Because we're glad the boxes didn't rot away to nothing, but oh, right, they are. They are chasing. There's the door. I'm gonna lock it behind you just to make sure that you don't get pinned against the wall. There she is. That you? It's time for a rescue. Lafui. <laughs> He's good. 
Glad you took a moment to appreciate. <laughs> the landlubber fell for it. Hook, line, and sinker. Thinks he can outmaneuver the smartest man on the seven seas. <laughs> Not hardly. First mate Jones. Aye, aye, sir. Take a battalion of your best men and raid the Cooper ship. There's sure to be some lingering rats about. What? Uh, sir! Don't cut me off while I'm speaking, or I'll cut you off from breathing. The Cooper ship is making for the open water, sir. Hmm, rats indeed. Make full sail with what must we got. If they make it out to sea, we'll never catch them. Aye, aye, sir. Bentley! Slides all blown up, and Lafouille's boat is gaining on you! How is it gaining on us? It doesn't have any sails left. If I can get into deeper waters, I should be able to give this guy the slip. But fly! Keep it together. We're not done yet. Blast! They'll make it out to sea in this wind. Jones! Aye, sir. Load the cannons and prepare to come about. If the breeze don't help, we'll fall back on iron and powder. Fire! Oh, they're just going to shell us. Brace! Ow! Avast there! Afraid you didn't quite make it out of the harbor. <laughs> Prepare to surrender your vessel. Sorry, Lefui, but I'm sure this water is deep enough. Deep enough to be your grave. Guru! Crusher! Now! Called it! Oh, by thunder! Just Crusher! Crusher! We're doomed! Ha go the ha! Good to see you too! I'll focus on freeing Penelope! You take care of any pirates that might come up on deck! Use the left and right analog sticks to control your tentacles. Then hit the R1 button and L1 button to smash guys. All right, let's pave them. Okay, so that's that one. And eh. I mean, I thought these guys were supposed to be terrified of this thing. I'm surprised they're not just evacuating. Just bomb your way through it, it's made out of wood! One down, three to go! Oh, he's gotta undo the screws! to take a second to ready their guns. Keep it up, Guru! Only two left! And they're really, they're really swarming us. Die! Okay, just <laughs> go nuts! Hi there. Bentley? Is that you up there? It's a rescue, Penelope! Hold tight! Oh, there's just one more screw! Just keep smacking. There we go. Done! Finally! Whoa. What is that outfit? Yo. Call up your squid, or that girl gets it. Back off, Guru. I'll deal with this guy. Aye, 
that you have. Set me up to think I got smart again. Then pulled me into the deep water with this beast. I tip me hat to you. You're the cleverest man I've ever had the pleasure of beating. You getting this lie? Yeah, I've got some perspective on the situation. The past! Ow! Guru, get Sly! He can't swim! Hi, shipmate, but who'll be We've come a cropper! Nobody touches that turtle but me. Me pirate flower finely blooms! Yet ye favor this cripple over me! The smartest man on the seven seas! Oh, I do like smart guys. And he beat you at your own game. You tell me who's more intelligent. <gasps> this still my heart and quick me blade. Tis time for a duel. You and I'll make the mating dance of death. Enough talk. Have at you. My pirate flower. That's short and bloody. <laughs> Whoa, alright. Use the left analog stick to jump and duck. What the hell? Hey, okay, this is gonna take some figuring. He really sends you flying with those hits. Use the left analog stick to jump and duck. Drive left wee backward by using your high and low attacks. Oh, okay. Okay, so don't bother attacking until he is, like, actually off his good guard. Okay, I'm getting it now. There we go. Down to the next one. Get back here. All right, I'm getting it now. There we go. So then, no attack. Okay, so he'll he'll doff his hat in different directions based on where I should attack him. I can tell already I would have gotten really stuck on this bit as a, if I'd played this as a kid. Thump! Stand and take it. Nope. Made him wrong. Duck. Back him. Him on the ground. Ah! Ah! Uh, so I actually press the button. Swat him. What is this rubber sword Penelope's using? I swear, like, the, the tip of it is, like, flexing. Uh, high attack, okay. Need to remember which button does what. There we go, high attack. Good hit. Down you go, Splosh. Keep saying it, eventually it'll become true. Yeah! Phew! Taking out the trash. Trash man. Lafree was beat. <laughs> Too easy, only took me four goes. Who'd done more than just rescue a team member, he'd won himself a girlfriend. Yay! It was nice to hear him talk. They'd have these conversations the rest of us couldn't even follow. As far as I could tell, they were made for each other. Now we need to just get Murray a boyfriend and we're good. Too. The new diving gear had gone to his head. 
We were in full. Oh god, he's so saggy. The Cooper Vault job. Not that any of us had even asked him. For the first time in memory, Carmelita didn't show up and cart everyone to jail. Oh well, I'll send her a postcard. You know, I'd hate to have her feel left out. <laughs> I didn't. Yeah, I didn't even realize that Carmelita wasn't with us for that one. Yeah, the squad. All right. So if my memory of the uh, prologue section is right, then uh, we now have the full team, and it's just yes, honor among thieves. Oh boy, the grand finale. I'm looking forward to this already, but we are well past time already, so that'll have to wait until Wednesday. I'll see you next time. I'm excited. Until then, thank you all for joining me. I'll see you on Wednesday. Good night and much love.